Okay, well, this is a game that I've played before already, but I didn't get to stream it as when I did. It, uh, it was 2017 that I didn't have, I didn't have internet <laughs> for like three months. So this is a game that kept me sane during that period, but I never got to stream it. And enough time has passed that I kind of forgotten about it. But also since we have the, uh, the upscaler now. Probably look nice to see it with 4K output. Or at least if you're watching later on YouTube. Because <laughs> that, that gets the 4K VOD. This doesn't. I wonder if someone's re-recorded this cutscene with, like, Jack Black. <laughs> hey, Nick, what's up? I mean, I think the upscaling does a good job. <laughs> really? I didn't know, I didn't even realize that. He says Peach in, in plain English, but then everything else is like... Rawr, 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 rawr. And if, why did I not notice that the first time around? I guess because I wasn't doing commentary to my gameplay. I was just playing the game. Okay. So, you know, don't expect good gameplay. It'll be mediocre at best. I am using the pro, pro controller, so we'll see. Kind of crazy. I always expected that they would have done DLC for this game, but they just did nothing with it. I feel like we're due for a new one. I know we just got uh, Wanda, but that's 2D Mario. So sorry for running away like that. You startled me, and I do startle easily. I saw what happened earlier. You've been through quite the ringer. You've landed in the Cap Kingdom. We've been under attack by the same monster that gave you such a trouncing. And to make matters worse, the fiend has kidnapped my little sister. <laughs> I'd hope to give chase to that monster in a ship of my own. Unfortunately, all of our airships were wrecked in the attack. Although, now that I think of it, I'm fairly certain there's a functioning ship in the next kingdom over. I could get us there if only I could reach the top of Top Hat Tower, which is being guarded by the monster's henchmen. You know, it seems we're after the same thing. Perhaps we should team up. Let's see if we can't help those two. Not your style? How about this? I have one of those those hats on my lamp. <laughs> it came with the game. I still have it. Oh, this is much easier than having to 
I'm not gonna I'm not going to shake the controller to throw it. <laughs> Better just miss that. You had a chocolate bar for breakfast. Just just a chocolate bar? My niece does that as well. Go out to breakfast and she has like a slice of cake or something for breakfast. But I guess she's like uh, under the age of 10. Coca-Cola as well. <laughs> All right, well now you have the balanced breakfast. I was worried it was just a chocolate bar, but the Coke, that's fine. What's wrong with cake for breakfast? I don't know. It's just sugar. That's it. Better than nothing. I can see the monster's minions from here, but all I can do is float helplessly and watch. Some cakes have eggs in them. <laughs> Are we going to go by the properties of, like, food? It's like, oh, it has breakfast elements inside. I mean, depending on the chocolate bar, it's like some of them use egg whites, and you've technically had eggs for breakfast. It's like, listen, if I if I had a Big Mac, right, and that's all I ate for my diet, I wouldn't go, well, it had lettuce, so I'm being healthy. <laughs> and at the end of the day, I'm eating just nothing but Big Macs. I could play this game again for the first time. I mean, granted, some of the stuff was spoiled in the trailers, but like, just this insanity here. I can't imagine this. This would be very. I don't know. I can't imagine this would feel very good to the frog. I should have a Big Mac for breakfast once now. I think the worst thing I do is just like a slice of leftover pizza and then I cook an egg and put the egg on top of the slice of pizza. I've had fried chicken for breakfast. But I have it with rice and stuff so it's like, it's more like a... Like an early lunch than a breakfast. Can you even order Big Macs for breakfast? I thought the menu is very restrictive in the morning. I have no idea. Neither. It's, it's been a minute since I've been to McDonald's for breakfast. breakfast menu is on. Yeah, but you can get certain things on the breakfast menu. It's not exclusively breakfast. One thing I've never understood is, like, they stop serving breakfast at 10.30. It's 
It's like, dude, breakfast should end when AM ends, not earlier. You can't get main menu items at breakfast? Oh, really? Here you can. And also there are all day breakfast items as well. You don't have that, really? I thought they were aiming to do that everywhere. Right, these things sound like minions. <laughs> God about this. You like the breakfast more than most many items. That's fair. I mean, McDonald's for me is just like nothing else is open. Or like I really want some McNuggets. That's pretty much the only time I'll get it. They lately have been tempted because they've got the, the chicken Big Mac, which is just the McChicken, but in a Big Mac, and there's, there's two of the, the chicken. <laughs> and the McChicken in Australia is like just a giant McNugget. So it's two giant McNuggets, and then it's in a Big Mac instead. <laughs> the boss warned me there'd be a fella with a mustache coming along. Guess we ought to introduce ourselves. We're the wedding planners for the happy couple. They call us the Brutals. We got that treasure we needed, so we ain't got no more business in these parts. Cause roughing up goody two-shoes metal as was in the contract. But I guess we still got a little work to do. Sausage, egg, McMuffin with a, slice of, with a side of nugs would be nice. Yeah, it's a shame you can't get that. You can get that here. <laughs> you know what I just did? Ah, oh, that's funny. Okay, so for the context of the, uh, the VOD later... Before this, I pl I played Warrior World, and Warrior's ability, uh, he can suck up coins with his mouth, so instinctively, I hit this dude on the head, a bunch of coins came out, and I pressed the trigger to suck up the coins, but Mario doesn't have that, so he just crouched. The chicken sandwich patty is different to the patty they put in the chicken Big Mac. Oh, really? Guess we're just lucky then. That can't, that can't be comfortable, like, that's gotta be painful. We have that smaller, uh, chicken, I mean, we say burgers, we don't say sandwich, but yeah, we have that. We, uh, what a ride, and we made it to the Cascade Kingdom. Sorry, still a bit amped from capturing a power line. Must collect myself. There should be an old airship somewhere around here. Let's see if we can find it. I was just, I found it really weird that 
I thought the McChicken was like a standard thing internationally, but it's not. I had an American friend that, um, just said they didn't like the McChicken. I'm like, why? And then they said they like McNuggets, and I was like, wait, that doesn't make sense. They're the same thing. And then what they described, I was like, oh, what? That doesn't sound good at all. What? Here, yeah, it's just a giant McNugget. That sounds terrible. All taste the same to you, different sizes. I think... The McChicken has its... Well, the McNugget has a flavor to it. I don't know how to describe it. You can tell the difference. The texture and the chicken itself, not really. It's more the coating. What a lucky break. This will come in handy to power the airship. Have you ever seen anything like it? Ah, there it is. This is what we were looking for. It's looking a bit more rough than I'd expected. Ah, no, it's just an older model. I'm certain it can still fly. Let's give it a shot. They're just throw me on the globe, though. Huh? Nothing's happening. That power moon must not have given the ship enough energy. Wonder if we can find more around here. I mean... I don't remember- I don't remember how to do the cap stuff. <laughs> I can't believe this game was released in 2017. Like, how insane is that? Just how long ago that was. I mean, towards the end of it, but still. It's, if I remember correctly, it's like you throw it, hang on, you throw it, and then you go. Yeah, like that. <laughs> Not that it did much, but... Oh, right, these things. The collect-a-thon. I guess there was purpose to it. Absolute madness. Just being able to control the T-Rex. Everything. Oh, there we go. I was going to say. Uh, 
Everything must go. <laughs> I don't think I can hit. <laughs> don't think I can hit that. forward to the, the jump rope thing. I'm prepared mentally for it. Yeah, right, this thing, hang on. Kick the rock. I think one of them does have a moon in it. I just can't remember which one. Okay, hang on. I think I need to take the T-Rex down. I don't remember where a lot of these moons are, so it's like... Well... We'll work through it. Do it. <laughs> I forgot about that. We. I'm releasing it early. Nice that. Yeah. Cappy's pretty cool. I have one in real life. Play there. Oh. <laughs> the pixel art. That happens later, if I'm not mistaken. There's a reason to come back to these stages. How nice the water looks. It's always been the way to impress just with new games is just how realistic the water gets. Music to this game is really good as well.
Oh, I got pulled. <laughs> How do you do this? It's like, yeah, there we go. I remember. Uh oh, metal, please don't give me a heart attack. It's gonna be nice and laid back playing this for the first, I don't know, couple of hours. But I know that later on, some of the stages, they can be a little tricky. I guess the first time I played it, no one was watching it because I was playing it off stream. So There's a little less pressure. Oh, it doesn't reach. I need T-Rex. I'll go get the, go the T-Rex. this T-Rex want to do is just take a nap. That's it. Here comes Mario interrupting the nap. What? Really? There's nothing here. Lies. I don't believe it. Alright. Onwards. Easy nostalgia points. The one disappointing thing, you can't use the D-pad for this section. Whoops, <laughs> whoops, whoops, whoops. Damn it. Ah, that was dumb. That was so dumb. It's just appeasing my inner child. Checking all the blocks. Yeah. 
Oh, this might be a bad idea. Okay, never mind. All I thought about when I saw this boss was just the, uh, the lady in Link's Awakening that has the pet chain chomp. Well, I could never part with any of my precious power moons. It sounds to me like someone wants to be a snack for my adorable chain chompkins. Chompikins, sorry. You're scared of what? <laughs> what are you scared of? noises she makes. <laughs> the old ball on chain, Oh. We've done it, and now we've got a multi-moon. Oh, it's as strong as three power moons combined. It should get the ship moving in no time. Let's see if we can make it work. Throw me at the globe. If I remember correctly, this is just like the intro, but then you can come back and do more. We've used enough fuel to reach the Sand Kingdom. Let's go save those two. Why don't you take the helm, select the Sand Kingdom, and we'll be off. Okay, so yeah, there's, there's a list. Like 25. <laughs> Let me do what I want to do. I know the Sand Kingdom's up next, but like, we're not done here yet.
So how do you like me as a captain's hat? Pretty classy, wouldn't you say? Now then, where were we? That monster's name is Bowser? Well, we'll chase him down in no time in the Odyssey. Seeing as how we've got some time to kill, let's review some useful skills. Travel tip. Ground pound. To smash blocks or enemies below you, or to fly in out bumps in the ground, there's nothing that beats a ground pound. Press that L in midair to do a ground pound, then pulverize with your posterior. Well, there it is. If you need some more review, you might want to look at the action guide. It's always there for your perusal. Just open the menu and select the action guide. We should discuss the Sand Kingdom too. If you've no doubt piece together, it's entirely covered in sand, and as you can imagine, it gets quite hot. Hmm, there are some ruins there, and an artifact called the Binding Band that links people forever, like a wedding ring. And this Bowser seems like the sort of creep that would seal a priceless antiquity for his sham wedding. Huzzah, I declare the maiden voyage of the Odyssey a complete success. But why is it so cold? I thought deserts were supposed to be hot. Huh? The top of that tower is shining, but how could that be? Could it be a power moon? I mean, we can always go back to the world after this one, so let's just do this one. So, so cold, cold. Everything just for rights all of a sudden. Still an exclamation mark. Okay. <laughs> this town's great. Hats. Hey, hey, we accept two kinds of coins coins and coins. You can use coins everywhere, but what? But coins only right here. Boxer shorts. I mean, I want all the outfits. Yeah. Okay. I want the sombrero. With, without failure, the sombrero is going to be acquired. A thousand just to go in boxer shorts? I mean, this was cool. Oh wait, wasn't there a- hang on. We gotta change clothing. Action guide. I think there's a moon for, like, changing into their clothing. Hang on. I think you need to go inside the ship to change. Oh, no, no, the co there it is. The wardrobe, I remember. Hey, hey. No? Oh, 
What do I remember walking into the store? Was that a dog? I remember there was a thing where you wore a particular costume and they'd give you a moon for it. It might be the sombrero one, maybe. Anyway. I guess we'll wear this for now. I do like how crazy the costumes get later. Hey! <laughs> Damn it. There's probably an easier way on this roof. Oh, right. Ours. <laughs> Got to think differently. Man, this music nostalgia. There's a prize in this party room, but you'll have to feel it. Walk around. Gyro. Rumble. It's not that. That's pretty strong. There it is. Got to justify the HD rumble. There's more. Okay, it's just a coin. I remember when they announced <laughs> that feature. It was so weird. That's the bird. Hey, 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 no, no, the bird, the bird. I need to talk to the bird. But like... They presented as as the dude felt like he had an ice cube inside the, uh... The Joy-Con. It was such a weird demo. What is the secret you're seeking? I know it, haha. I can't tell you, but I'll give you a clue. Sand quiz is wonderful. Hiding somewhere, no peeking. Gotta find it. Yeah. It's a secret bird. Okay, I need to find more seeds. So, what happened to the music? There's no music. <laughs> what happened to the music? <laughs> oh, there we go. Weird. Yeah. 
These coins kind of make me want corn chips, not gonna lie. Especially the name of the town. Careful not to mess this up. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> well, yeah. There goes that. I don't remember. You take it somewhere. But death is rather inconsequential in this game. Nothing. All right, never mind. to be revealing something. Stop telling me to cran pan. That's not the move that I need to do right now. Oh, what is that? Okay, fine. Corn chips. I love that all the costumes as well have pixel art, like, man. This is what was sorely missed from Mario Maker 2. They just got rid of all the, the costumes you could wear in it. It's like a big deal in the first game. Oh, what? It's not gonna just let me have it. Come here. Up the highest tower. Ah. Okay. Useful.
I'm just gonna make sure everything is fine before going in. I have chips, but I don't have corn chips. Good. How come the other ones don't get special treatment? I guess these are the bare minimum ones. chain reaction. Oh no. Not good. Okay. <laughs> it's still alive. Oh, these things. These things are funny. They have special cool glasses. I love how weird this is. I'm getting those coins. I need more spending money. Missing somewhere. Mario stoned. Is 
didn't waste any time for that one. Oh, it's just there, dummy. Good job, it was super obvious. <laughs> Bing, wahoo! It is leading me down the path of finishing this, but there's... I don't know why I jumped across. There's other things to do. But you're laughing at me like wanting money for costumes. Oh, this is the bus stop. the right thing. Should probably go back here first. Moon. Could try to get greedy and make it in one one go, but I don't know. No, no, no. Okay, it's fine. I really don't remember some of the stuff. Which is good. Enough time has passed that I don't remember much about the game. <laughs> This works. Does it even do anything? I thought when you sat on this, a bus came. <laughs> I 
Okay. I'm wrong. Oh yeah, the roll. Okay, I need to get used to this. The roll thing is, is vital for like doing certain sections later. There's one level in particular that, oh man. Well, we'll see what happens when I get up to it, but. I remember it taking me a while. <laughs> the sheep. Some of the moons are pretty giveaway. I know there's something you have to do with these, but I don't remember what. I think you have to, like... Yeah. But I don't remember where. Oh, over here. <laughs> Eat the sheep. There you go. That's one. <laughs> That's two. What was really unsettling about this game is just seeing real humans in the game. And what I mean by that is like, well, Mario isn't real human if you look at all the other characters in this game. Well, it looks creepy by comparison. There's a really good animation where, like, there's a, there's just these dudes having a conversation, and then a cappy lands on this dude's head, <laughs> and Mario possesses him. It's 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 so funny because you don't see it coming. Let's see if I can find it. Sphinx. Forgot about the quiz, Sphinx. It's gonna ask me questions that I probably haven't been paying attention to. Where's this last sheep? Yeah, not not yet. Not yet. What if it's like the the classic wild animal prank that people did at schools, like just There's no there's no shape number three. Oh jeez, that was heading in a bad direction. Gonna prepare some chicken for later, we'll be listening. <laughs> Fair enough. Have fun. But the classic prank of like, uh, you know, you get, you get three animals and you let them loose in a public space, usually a school. You usually have three of them, so you label them. You have label one number one, one number two, and one number four. 
So then they just they just keep looking for animal number three that doesn't exist. Where this sheep is. What if that was it? What if I'm not remembering it correctly? I would have run into it by now, surely. I'm gonna go back and see what he says. Panicking. My beautiful sheep, three of you have escaped. Yep. There's one more somewhere. <laughs> Greetings, traveler, into your head as well. Can you answer my riddle? What does the thieving monster desire from this land? Ring. You are correct! Perhaps that wasn't much of a riddle. Anywho, proceed. Oh, not yet. Not yet, not yet, not yet. I must find this sheep. I bet it's going to be somewhere really far away. It's going to make me yeet it for like an eternity. I have enough coins to get the sombrero. Oh, what if one of them's in the ice? I didn't even consider that. Some of, some of the stuff looks like I can't do until later. There'll be some I can do. Ah. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't think I needed to do that. You can climb. Drop. I'm 
at least this wasn't for nothing. I got something out of it. Seems a little suspicious. I bet the shape was consumed by the ice. Explain why I can't find it. Could be on the roof of the pyramid, because I know this thing does fall down. Alright, I'm going into the Sphinx. I think there's a second quiz for him. Okay, uh, door down here. memory. as he falls in. Whoops. Thought I had the answer. I do not. It's here.
I don't know. I reckon the shape is on top of the building. It has to be. Anything? I don't remember. No, it's not. <laughs> it's okay. Where the desert stage was it? You would purposely go down into a ravine and there'd be a secret. Oh, it's like in the center? Okay, hang on. Let me get the coins. The camera was weird, it just... There we go. I thought so. I guess I just didn't walk into it in time. do stuff that I shouldn't. <laughs> Just keep going. looking. I guess I makes up for the coins I lost. How you doing? I'm what you call a jaxi. You want to ride? It'll be 30 coins. What is- Oh, I see what you- Okay. So what do you want to do? Some sightseeing? You gotta check out the inverted pyramid. Money? Yeah. I'm gonna need a lot of it if I want all these costumes. Oh! Oh, no, it's fine. I thought that was death there for a sec. No, we, we need this, we need this, we need this. <laughs> oh. That's much easier. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I'm not good at racing games anyway, but look, this is rough controls. 
There's a cactus that had light on it. I need to find it. that we're paying for this. <laughs> Can't offer a comfortable way. Let me see if there's anything else I should do whilst I'm on this thing. Mario looks like he's doing the crazy frog. Man, that's a name I haven't heard in a long time. I found them for the, just a while there. I suppose things haven't changed, but just... People being obsessed with something that just makes funny noises for minutes on end. Oh, you can't go. Okay. Alright, I'd, I'd say this is fine. I'll just go now. To the pyramid! Actually, no, I got a better idea. No, I don't. <laughs> I was trying to turn around. I was going to go get my sombrero. That wasn't my, my better idea. My better idea was uh, living and going to get a sombrero. Oh, he didn't charge me again. All right, cool. So, once off fee. Okay. Ah. I love this town. This town is so cool. to happen. I must buy everything. I'll leave it for now. The rest can wait. Dress like us, party like us. That's what we say anyway. So, snappy hat, check. Snazzy poncho, double check. You are ready to party, head inside. I want to stay here forever. Guitar. 
It's just missing the old dude, like, yelling. Can't have that kind of music without someone yelling at the start of the song. My dad played music like that early in the morning, and man, <laughs> just... Uh, 7 a.m. and then you hear the old dude, like, just yelling. With the, uh, the ranchero music. Now I'm going into the pyramid. No, and I would have gotten corn chips instead of potato chips. <laughs> just these, this currency just makes me want to want to get corn chips. It's too late now. It's like ten thirty at night. Unless I went to a gas station or something. But then I'd be paying gas station prices. Extra couple bucks for convenience, pretty much. Though if you go to a 7-Eleven and buy two, it ends up being the same price as, like, one bag. Well, buying two bags that aren't on special, that's like... There's these new, uh, like, corn chip substitutes that have appeared here. They're marketed as, like, the healthier alternative, but it's... It's like popcorn triangles, so... They're shaped like corn chips, but they're popcorn instead. They're pretty good. You get the triangle, you get the powder. It's just not... Like, corn chip. Upside down stages always mess with my head. <laughs> Ever had Bugles or Dorito 3Ds? Dorito 3D was like a very temporary thing, but they were good. Bugles we can find at um like specialty stores that sell American stuff. Um Dorito 3Ds were really good. why I'm doing that. Oh, I see why. It's good timing. Kind of boring with our snack foods here. We don't really have fancy ones anymore. You can find them, but you just have to go to places that just import them. Generally, the potato chip limited edition flavors, they're 
a bit weird. There is one that does, um, kettle cooked ones that do pretty good limited edition ones. But some of them are just weird, like they do short rib flavor or something like that, and it's just, it doesn't taste anything like it. Looking for the binding band chumps? Too bad, the boss has it now. And you guys ain't invited to the wedding. And they still haven't made Cool Ranch like a regular thing with Doritos here yet. You can find it, it's just not as common. Cool Ranch is good. It's alright. I like it. But just every time I heard about Cool Ranch, people made that like it was the best. Like, oh my god, you have to have Cool Ranch. How could you not have Cool Ranch Doritos? Not the best, but it's good. Yeah, that's how I would put it. It's alright. What do we have to do with her? Hang on. Let me pay attention to what I'm doing. Oh, right, that, yeah, there we go. It's simple. You like the Blazin' Buffalo Ranch? Ooh, Blazin' Buffalo Ranch? Yo, that sounds good. <laughs> Anything that has some kind of spicy flavor, sign me right up. I'll keep an eye open for that one. The only interesting thing we have from snack food point of view is like a, we have uh, Cheeto balls. So they're Cheetos, but they're balls. And one of the flavors I have is cheese and bacon. It's pretty decent. How they just violently explode. See, when you look at this, was what I was doing in Warrior any stranger than what I'm doing in this? Not really. I think just with Warrior. The game just does butt jokes. <laughs> it's basically... I think that's the difference between the two. It's just, Warrior has more ass involved. Yeah, that, the dumpy. <laughs> that brutal slowed us down a bit, but we're still racking up power moons. How odd, the inverted pyramid is floating, and it's gotten even colder. Is this more of Bowser's doing? I say. does make trouble, doesn't he? I mean, Wario's brand is, is weird, but... There's definitely strange things in Mario games. Ha 
I have enough to purchase the uh, the big one now. I probably shouldn't. I have a few more coins. It's terrible. It's gotten so much colder. Now the inverted pyramid is floating in the air. Freezing winds are blasting out of the huge pit where it was. These little skeleton dudes remind me of Alpha from the Power Rangers, just always panicking. <laughs> but calm down. I got this. Ay ay ay! There's trouble. Wait, what is this? Play some slots, the Toast Arena game where that's winning worldwide fame. 10 coins to play. Okay. Oh, gambling. Oh, yes. Okay, well, I fucked that one up. Good. <laughs> yeah, that's what I wanted to do. I don't know how I shot that on an angle, but the, the cool, man. <laughs> that was that so hard. <laughs> oh dear. I love the music in this room. Anything that brings back Mario 3 nostalgia, I'm all for it. Ah, oh. oh, damn it. Stop. Ah, oh, I missed. Okay. I'll just remember the bird. That you have to harass. Forget where the best vantage point for it to snipe is. Where is it? Oh, it's over at the Oasis now. It should come back. I hope. <laughs> Either way, I can see its flight path here and I can figure out. Or I should try to get it. You know what? At this point, I may as well go for the other one. Oh! <laughs> Don't. Whoops. Oh. Go away. had that. I just needed to land it. Is it on its way back? Mm, probably won't be back anytime soon. There we go. I <laughs> don't know why I complicated that. It's going to be away for a while. Oh, 
Oof, these things are brutal. Okay. Not fun. Need health, please. All right, the bird is on its way back. I think here's the best place to get it because it looked like it was on fairly low ground. Like, I could probably intercept it here. If I do this and practice, yeah, so something like that. Okay, here it comes. Even just standing in the tree would do it. Okay, here we go. Oh. Too low, too low, too low, too low, too low, too low. Get up. No, get it. Oh, get it! Ah! Oh, <laughs> damn it! Ah! Uh, okay, I think camping the trees is probably the best bet. I'm not gonna wait for it. I'm not gonna wait for it. I'm not gonna wait for it. I'm just gonna go. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I'll come back for it later. Hey, Colin, how's it going? <laughs> going good, can't sleep. What time is it over there? Oh, that's, yeah, that's like on the edge of still should be sleeping and time to get up for some. Oh, I see. my day. Uh, Alright, it was really humid here today, so I kind of just stayed indoors and just did stuff around the house. Um, a neighbor or somewhere, someone. Someone. Did some cooking, most likely, and burnt their beans. So, like, most of uh, outside, like in the corridor, smells like burnt beans. I did a little on the inside here earlier on in the day, but I've aired it out. And I know it's burnt beans, that's the thing. It's like, you might ask, well, how do you know it's burnt beans? I know it's burnt beans. I know what they smell like. Oh, 
Could have been less had Naiba's burn fish. Oh. That is worse. I mean, that, it's fine. Like, I, the smell of it doesn't bother me. It's just I know what it smells like. I know what it is. Such a neat mechanic, the hat. Yeah, this was this game's big thing. It's just how do you make a Mario game different? Possess enemies and things. As long as the apartment building didn't go on fire. Yeah, well, no, I didn't even think about that until now. I don't think I can... Oh, no, they're... Okay, I see, I see, I see. I see. There we go. How many floors are there? Uh, there's a ground floor that only has a few apartments in it. And then there's two floors above it. Like the ground floor doesn't really have many people living down there. Just um, I'm in. I'm on the the first floor. The ground floor only has people that need access to ramps and stuff. There's a lot of people that have assisted living here. Old school Super Mario Brothers on the wall. Yeah. I love the nod to it. Every single costume gets its pixel art as well, which is pretty neat. This game's a good one. Wish I could have streamed it back in the day, but... <laughs> could not. was, uh, yeah, different times for me. At least I have easier access out in the emergency. What? I don't. No, I'm on the first floor. Like, I have to go down a flight of stairs. Not that it's that much, but... It's better than the second. That's true. I mean, if I want to jump off the balcony... To do it quickly, I could <laughs> be fine. It's not that high up. I'm just seeing what else has changed out here. I guess we go into the pyramid now. The abyss. Do I work on Monday? Yeah. I'm back at work this week. These are the last couple of days. There's a public holiday coming up, so... Hey, come here. I love that the purpose of these things is so you don't slip on ice. Your next day off isn't until the end of May, damn. 
Let's see, I have January 26th, then... Wait, what about Easter? You don't get Easter off? I mean, we have a lot of... It's on a Sunday, that doesn't matter here. Here, we have Good Friday, which is a public holiday. And then we have the Monday and Tuesday. Well, I think the... Yeah, I, I have to remember how it works, but, like, it's a really long weekend, that one. Oh, okay. I mean, Australians are always on holiday. That's just the thing. Ah! Oh! There we go. Jeez. That is very specific. <laughs> okay, back into the tower. That is a pretty awesome mechanic, this. I'm gonna go with Al. So what? What is this? This is like a. We. Oh, I see what I've done. I have, I have seen the error of my ways. Get out, get out. <laughs> Whoops. You gave up on 100%ing this game, really? Well, live vicariously through me, because I'm sure I'm going to do it. Don't you fucking dare, jeez. Don't, don't let the last 15 seconds influence, like, how much confidence you might have that I'm gonna actually achieve that. You saw the prices on the costumes and gave up? Oh, well. It doesn't take that long. There are certain stages you can do to farm money pretty easily. And if you die a lot, hey, you get to collect the coins all over again. I mean, the end game ones are really expensive, but the whole thing is just, yeah, always be collecting. Remember your ABCs. You were 100% up until that point. Oh. I mean, they are very expensive. I think the way I got it was just because, uh, I mean, eventually I did die a lot <laughs> in some of those stages, so. I amassed coins. I love that they wear little protective visors, so I don't steal them. You lost coins buying star locations. Oh. Yeah, don't do that. Or moon locations. Who 
Here we go, a boss that has to make an appearance in every 3D Mario game. Though admittedly, this version of the fight is cool. He says as he almost goes off the edge like an idiot. Forgetting how this actually works. So funny. It's a fun fight. the control. always love this outfit. Oh, it's so hot now, but I suppose that's what we were trying to accomplish. If we keep up this pace, we'll catch that Bowser in no time. Do we have enough power moons to reach the next kingdom? If you want to check, put me on the globe. We're not doing that yet. We definitely do, but we're not doing that yet. Hi, Mario. Oh, yeah, no, no, no. No. Waste the money. You'll never 100% I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh no! Okay, go, 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 chase it, chase it, chase it, chase it, chase it. Go, Mero, go! going to... it's going to go near this tree here. Go! Oh, get it! Ah. Okay, it's not over, it's not over, it's not over. Oh, you've got to be shitting me. No, it's too far away. 
Ha! Damn it. I've got to wait. What do you need that bird? It gives you a moon. That's why it's all sparkly. Wow. Oh. Look at how this works, hang on. <laughs> I love that they all get Mario's face. Hey, take the bait. And the music is a little relaxing here. I think it classic bob fishing. That didn't work. Someone give me a haiku to read. Mario related. Got it. <laughs> Never mind. It's just the music is it's very... It reminds me of Ghost of Tsushima where he just... reads some haiku. It's, it's, it's been a while. <laughs> Is this this bird back? Oh, the timing on that. All right, all right, all right. Here we go. Here we go. <gasps> no. Shit. <laughs> Shit. Shit, 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 shit. Oh, you dickhead bird. Come on, you. <laughs> There's not really any good Mario hikers, damn. What about like proverbs, like he who spin it, win it? Oh, that's what that is. How does this work, though? Oh, I've got fishing in the sand. That makes sense. It's Captain Toad, isn't it? Yeah. 
I got buried there. I'm so lucky I came along. Now I'm just my toad voice. I can't do it for more than 15 seconds. All right, I'm done. Oh, but I found a power moon under the sand. Thanks for the rescue. Yeah. I don't know why they made his voice like that. It used to be normal in cartoon shows. <laughs> but then at some point someone decided... All right, I'm not. I'm not gonna hurt my voice. I'll, I will stop. And that—that's a promise. Have I played Treasure Tracker? Yeah, I played it last year. I did a replay of it. Hey, dude, you up for a challenge? Everyone loves walking, right? Problem is, most don't take it seriously. That's what trace walking is all about. If you can walk like a champ, you'll win a prize. Alright. Sweet. Walk around and follow the arrows. Oh no, I remember the shit. This is like how good of a circle you can draw. Oh, fuck this up. That's not too bad. That's not too bad, honestly. Hell yeah. Ha! <laughs> Alright. I, I have cactus on my nose, but uh, yeah. Thought that was going to take longer than it did. Wait, is that the same bird or a new bird? They can bet! This has to be a new bird. There's no way it's the same bird. It's, a, it's yeah, different bird. Okay. <laughs> that one wasn't as bad. Don't touch that stuff. Maybe you can write something across it. Already done. Speaking of, I need to go get it again because um, there's like an underground spot in there. I think this is the strangest part of this game is just what I was saying. Like, if these are humans, what is Mario? Taxi, taxi, you pulled up finally. Take me to the Metro Kingdom. Sorry about the hold up. Had some car trouble. You would not believe. Can't leave for the Metro Kingdom yet, though. I'll promise I'll get you there. Just gotta. Do I dice the everything? Yes, damage the car. Mario isn't Italian and those are Americans. Are you saying all Italians look like Mario? Are you saying by comparison you're taller than than most people? You're good! <laughs> I 
there. Get the coin! Get the... Get the corn chips. Poisonous grape. Grape jelly. <laughs> Hang on. Okay. Ah! <laughs> Shit. Okay. But this is what these rings are here for. It's so hard to steer this thing. Oh, piss off. No. Turn around. Do it again. Again! No, get off. <laughs> get the moon. You know what it needs to make? It needs to make that sound effect. Like, the sex panther sound effect! What did I do that for? <laughs> I jumped off, I was trying to break. Sex panther. I mean, it's just... Damn it. Stock panther sound. It's like, what is that? Hang on. Let me see if I get it right. Sex Panther by Odeon. It's illegal in nine countries. <laughs> yep, it's made with bits of real panther, so you know it's good. Yeah, that. <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh, I hate the staring on this thing. You've never s heard of the Sex Panther thing, Star? It's from Anchorman. Okay, hold on. Sometimes I believe the power of music can get you out of binds. Let me, let me test this out, okay? Entertain me. Turning the audio off for a minute. And we're gonna go with... Okay, here we go. All right. Believe this is Crash Bandicoot and you can win!
What'd I tell you? <laughs> Just manifested a game that involves dodging. Okay, we're out of here. It's a commonly used sound. Yeah, I mean, it's a stock sound. I would not be surprised. Anyway, that's, that's all I think of when I hear the sound is just Anchorman and Sex Panther. I tried to find the PS1 version of the song, but it didn't have one that was long enough, and I wasn't sure if it was going to, uh, it was gonna go for a while. I've seen people get to the, t get to over there. Or at least try to. Oh, here we go. I found the nut. It's time to nut. Come on. Now I remember what these are for. <laughs> these Mario Sunshine ass stages. like I'm playing Wario again. Oh no. Everything is under control. No need to panic. Oh, 
I love the artwork on this. Oh no, there are corn chips over there. Carefully. I forget how to acquire corn chips. I think I need to just drop onto it. Oh, <laughs> all right. Not like that. Oh, repeat the whole thing again? I don't have to get the moon again, do I? Pretty sure the moons are just permanently acquired. Yeah, it's acquired. But for some coins, why not? I could just grab the coins and just die and that's fine. <laughs> oh, that was. Oh, that was close. Salvaged. I thought for sure I was screwed. Look at this dude partying on the roof. Damn it. There we go. Mario may get a concussion, but fine. Oh, this. Um. Oh, crap. I did the wrong thing. I dove. <laughs> Whoops. I better stop. This was. I think this is like way later. <laughs> what the? Oh, I can change the station. Here we go. <laughs> oh, 
Ah, oh, what have I done? I didn't press B. I thought it was just it's gonna open up on its own. It is getting to the point in the evening where the midnight brain's gonna kick in. Suppose while I'm here. She'll buy the boxer shorts. there. Okay, there's just 12 coins to go. Okay, this time, come on, don't. Oh, this is. Okay, okay, um. Perfect. <laughs> there we go. Don't think I need this thing for anything else. I never did solve the mystery of the second shape, or third shape. I thought maybe when the pyramid moved it might appear, but... We can have a look around now. Slingshot? Oh, uh, not yet. Get more coins. He's still panicking. I don't know where your last sheep is. from lack of looking like I've, I've looked. Oh. Sneaky corn chips. What I need to do is. There we go. What? 
Oh, crawl. I love how it explained that to me midway. No idea what this the sheep is. Sheep. <laughs> ah. <laughs> okay. Get back into your home. How was it? Hey. Where are you going? Get back. Hey. I don't know how I did not come across that sheep sooner. first. See a musical note thing. Huh? Didn't I see a musical note thing? Well, there's the P button. Oh, I hate this. Just. I think I was supposed to do that with the, uh, the stone guy. But I just, yeah, did it without it. Hmm, maybe I'm wrong. I thought that was a music note thing, but there isn't. That looks like a bad move. Well, unfortunately, there's only one way back for the looks of it.
Oh, come on. How do I trick it? Maybe the hat will let me trick it. Oh. Or well, the hat will stun it. Oh, what do you mean? Has to be dead on. you back. Which I guess I'm surprised I didn't do that. map not action control this uh, lists there's still oh, there's still a lot <laughs> there's still a lot I think some of them just come from the shop if I'm not mistaken it does let you buy quite a few of them from the store Hang on. Where's the other one? Okay. Some of them are just, you spot what's out of place. Thank you. Did, it, did the shape get loose again? Okay, quiz number two. Thirty. I 
The foreign visitor traveling by car. What stopped his journey? Nice. Oh, now three correct answers. Well done, traveler. I've been saving this one. Answer this. Atop the inverted pyramid, how many statues of the sand gulpers are there? Five? Yeah. That's correct, but... Did you really know that? There were six, but one is gone, leaving five. I did know that! Did you guess? You guessed, didn't you? No. You're a guesser. No, I'm not. Persistent. Very well. It is time for the real test. This will be your final question, and no guessing. I didn't guess! What's my name? Mr. Question Face. Suffix Wizard. Quiz Kitty. Sphinx. Ah, gah! You got them all right. Everyone falls eventually, I suppose. Well done, take this. I have no more questions for you. No guessing? I didn't. I knew there were five up there. What are the odds that I'm lying? One, five? I'm pretty sure this dude makes you do a second one. Oh, I had a prize. Never mind. This one that was a harder version. It's just because the, sta the statue thing was just so recent. That's the only reason I got it. It was because I, I was just up there, so I had the mental picture still. I just imagined what it looked like, and yeah, the I saw five statues. <laughs> I don't know what to say. It took note of my surroundings. There was like a ramp that I saw from a distance. I think that's what I was looking for. It's the other nut. Oh. Can I... Okay. Careful. I don't want to accidentally get rid of it. The other nut should have grown. Yep.
Oh, there's another one. Getting there. I suppose the only thing I'm missing is just the actual coins. Um, are you selling more moons? Apparently not, not yet. Okay. So there's one more. I mean, generally I just go to the parts of the map where it looks empty. It's possible that there's another bird one if I wait for the bird on the hill. Like maybe it's three birds. This was the hill. Hold on, controls vibrating. Aha! <laughs> okay. Well, I mean, either way, I got one. It's just a question of whether or not the bird is, is even one or not. I don't... Oh, it's all the... Well, that's the lake bird. Well, and I heard a... That one I can't get. I know that one's, like... The, the one that you get when you're in another... World. But you can't get it in this one. This just moves the platform across. I don't think there's anything else over there. Let me have a look. Oh, it's a bridge. Well, that makes life easier. I just need to look for more things that look out of place. I think it's just the same bird from the first time. I'll look at the uh, the scope things. Oof, see if I can spot anything out. lose his sheep again. Is that a separate moon or is this just gross negligence? I think it's just the same thing again. Okay, so the only thing I haven't used is the slingshot, but that's just to get back up there. Hey.
This is still the same. Doesn't look like there's anything new here. I think this is just gonna take me through the same thing again. Okay, ow. I'm trying to see if there's anything I've missed. It does not look like it. I'll go through it just to say I've done it, but I think it's all good. Plus we get to see this again. More coins. I don't think I got a moon from this section. I wonder if there's like a hidden moon with this 8-bit section. I bet there is. Just look at that. Yeah, hang on. There's another pipe over there. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Sneaky. Okay, that, that is super sneaky, but that's not what I was trying to look for. Yep. Okay, well that solves another mystery. Oh, nice. Well done. found mm, most of the ones in here. I refuse to buy hints unless I'm super, super stuck. I have to look at what else is out of place. Damn it, I wanted the extra coins. Maybe it might lead to something else. It does not. Ow. 
Ow. It would imply that there's like another B1 to do somewhere. Because it said. Hang on. Ah, oh, no, I've done Time of Challenge 1. Jeez, that was almost a mistake. <laughs> almost walked into the cactus. I wouldn't be surprised if another one of the hills had like a... a ground pound thing. I can feel something here. That's just health. I guess I needed it. I'm still missing four coins. For some reason, I remember him being on the edge of the map. But I could be wrong. This is definitely something. I need to go get the Jaguar. Just here. Okay. Thought I was moving it somewhere. Hopefully this doesn't end in tragedy. Turn around! Somewhere over here. Oh crap. Messed it up. Oh wait, no I haven't. Here, 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 here. I love that it, it does that for you. That's all good. Oh, you were taking me to see family? You old softy. 
I appreciate your kind gesture. Come see me anytime again. Okay. Crazy traits with this. I went in here, right? Oh, yeah, we've been in there. Just double check, but pretty sure. Yeah, we've been in here. Seeing anything else that looks out of place. Oh my. Oh, it's not done yet. Almost. Dogger. Follow the dogger. looking for it's a nice hat a wait I'm trying to get it out <laughs> Why is this here? Sorry. I don't know, I distinctly remember a taxi taking you somewhere, but I think that's later. Chasing me. It's probably something else to this. Oh, jeez. That was close. That was some mad reaction there. I just want to make sure I don't miss anything here. Yeah. 
Oh, okay. Suddenly I remember this. <laughs> oh no. I remember. Gimba Tower. This, this sucks. Go, Gimba Tower, go. I'm still missing some coins. I did go down there, but... Possible I may have missed stuff still. Ah, it doesn't hurt to look. There's a moon up there. I can see it. Ugh, damn it. I was even looking up in that direction. I was like, I remember, but I wasn't 100% certain. to do it. Oh. Stop. <laughs> I, I did the thing. Stop. another suspicion. Never mind. No idea where the last coins are. I've been pretty good with that.
But I got the feeling it's like an alternate path or something here. That was almost fatal. This is good, like, <laughs> I thought I'd remember too much, but I don't. Done the scarecrow thing. Oh, what? No! Get off. These last coins have to be somewhere very obscure. I can't imagine they'll be in plain sight. I feel like I've been everywhere. the last of the corn chips. <laughs> I want my last four corn chips. <laughs> hey, Messiah, how's it going? How's things? Flowers probably done by now. <laughs> Seems rather. <laughs> hmm. There they are. Okay, but there's still three more. I'm doing okay. Been pretty humid here today, so. Yeah. So someone burnt beans in the building, so it smells a lot like burnt beans outside. Summer has been non-existent. It's been... There's been a couple of hot days here and there, but it's just been... Honestly, it's been more like spring. I haven't really had much of a summer. The hottest has gotten is like 35, which is nothing. I mean, I'm alright with that. Like, it's not like I go to the beach heavily. Well, 35 Celsius, which, uh, I don't know, convert it. <laughs> it's past midnight. I can't do the conversion in my head right now. Too lazy. Well, it's like... I was to take a guess, 107, but I'm not sure. Let's see. 35. Uh, 35. I can't believe it. 95. I was close. 107 is like when it's super hot. So. I was close. 
It's not that I know how to convert it, it's that I know, like, the three key numbers I talk about. It's like, if it's 107, then it's like, well, you know it's boiling hot here. It's hot for you. Ah, eh, I mean, acclimation. I'm used to it. Cold, on the other hand. I say it's winter and most people will laugh at me for what I consider winter. I must have missed these coins some... Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I think the coins might be with the final moon. Like the one that you get when you come back to the stage on your own. Pick up the... They look like normal coins. Maybe not. The problem we have here is just the UV is really strong here. So that's the pe the mistake people make when they visit Australia in summer is they're like, oh, I'm going to get a nice tan. And then they don't realize how quickly you get burnt. Like the UV rating is, is pretty insanely high here. Is my plant done? Yep. Apparently, how there's like three that. Done quite a few. Some of them are just buying moons, so. Sometimes you have to do certain ones a second time. Yeah, here was just you know, just annoying. I'm just waking up to the smell of burnt beans. To make half a building smell like burnt beans, you really have to mess up something fierce. Which is my favorite kingdom, this one. The outfit and also just the skeleton dudes. The whole Dia de los Muertos thing. I like it. gonna drive me crazy these last <laughs> last three corn chips you enjoyed seaside seaside's cool i don't mind the uh the food kingdom as well food kingdom's very bright and colorful
I'm super rusty. I, I haven't played this since when it first came out, so I don't remember a lot of it. Like right now I'm drawing blanks as to where certain moons are right now. I am pretty positive I've been everywhere. I guess the only possibility is like in the 2D puzzle, maybe. I missed something. Oh man, it's past midnight. I gotta head out soon. <laughs> I've kind of gotten carried away with finishing this shit. I mean, these last ones are going to be somewhere where I just don't remember and they're just out of view. From what I remember, every two, practically every 2D section has a secret area. Sometimes it's as simple as just continuing. Chips. I probably shouldn't have rushed through that. So hang on, I haven't gotten a secret from this, so... Ah! Okay, there we go. Every 2D section has a moon. But it's not the coins I'm looking for. The answer has to be something very simple. Aside from the ones that were like on the very edge of the stage, I do remember those. I can't imagine the remaining three are going to be somewhere annoying. Maybe they are. Underground treasure chest. See, these are clues. The bird's good. In the ground. Well, the only... Just a couple of underground places. Oops. With Mario concussion. Oh, 
It's either referring to the big hole in the middle of the map, or... I mean, I did this one. I think this is just pointing to this, which is, like, somewhere here. Yeah, I've got that. Underground. There's a few areas that fall under that description. underground we'll see I haven't checked there so the corn chips are definitely another sub area possibility of there's like a second one here. I got the moon. I'll oh, bounce off it. It's frustrating. But that was the end there anyway, so screw it, I'll just do it. Mess me up. Uh, what? <sighs> I missed the jump. I was trying to do it fancy by bouncing off the hat. Mario, please. Just. my bad. Oh, come on! <laughs> I'm jumping too early. Ugh. This isn't, this isn't even going to be worth the effort that I'm putting in. Well, the only other place that fits the description of underground. Oh, wait a minute. A 
Holy crap. This is the thing. Come here. I was right. Let me out. <laughs> oh, what? Okay, roof of the building. Has to be a way onto the roof of the building. How? I forgot how to do this. There is there is definitely a way. Otherwise, why would those coins be up there? Hang on. Look. Honestly, don't remember. I think I need to go to the other entry. I have vague memories, but it's not enough to go off. This was something. You can hear a sound effect. There's a way to get to the wall. I don't remember. I, don't... I think it just puts you up there. I don't think you have to scale it or something. Let me try something. Nope, okay. Thought maybe that would be it. this way as I go. See ya. At least I got a moon. Whoa. 
why do I get the feeling that the coins are in the... The bottom thing. It said underground, so... Alright, anyway. Let's just return these for now. Wee. <laughs> I only needed six. Uh-oh, we've hit a proverbial fork in the road. Which kingdom do you want to go to? Go to the wooded one. I can come back to it. I just wanted to put the moons in. Am I going for 100%? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Just, I'm not gonna stick around in one world. I'll come back for it. He kidnapped Gara now with this wedding band. He's got a wedding ring. Is he going to steal a whole wedding? Seeing as how we've got time, some time to kill, let's review some useful skills. Okay. Yeah, we know this already. I've done it before. I think I... I'm only missing like 10 or so, so it's not too bad. Wait, do you hear something? Okay. Alright, I gotta leave it here. For tonight. But this was fun. We'll pick this up again tomorrow more most likely <laughs> oh mario uh anyway thanks for watching if you are watching later on youtube and sticking around to the end if you've enjoyed so far and want to support the channel just do things like click the like button or you can also watch me play other things by clicking on the videos that pop up thank you to those that do do that it does help out the channel out a lot so appreciate it but we'll see you next time